everybody, welcome back to Seemly Tuber again. And in this video, we have a clip for the internet I wanted to give a little reaction to. I wanted to give a little take on. I just wanted to go to show y'all that like, this generation is really cooked out here, bro. This clip is from a Pop the Balloon Challenge. We got a dude out here acting very weirdly. And I just wanted to show y'all that like, you can tell when someone's never talked to a baddie because this dude acts so weird you can tell that he's never talked to a woman that's beautiful at all he's dealt with mediocre self-conscious girls all his life that it, it just never worked out for him let's jump into this clip so i can show you what i'm talking about well yeah you find it Ooh, right. so you can see here bro's already acting like a pure creep bro who asked women to do a 360 and for the women out there that actually do 360s y'all don't respect yourselves at all but you can tell this lady doesn't respect herself at all because look at what she's wearing bro you got a g-string thong on and you can see it outside of your clothes and you got a top on that don't even go or cover everything on your body but then we're gonna see in the next clip she's gonna say that this dude is tweaking but you're also out here dressed like that. Yes, this dude is a weirdo, but you're also to blame because you are sitting yourself out here to objectify yourself. And then you expect when a weirdo like this approaches and tells you to do a 360 and then he starts giggling and stuff when he's talking to you and acting weird. That's not normal behavior because you're putting yourself out there for Weird folks like him. Ooh, he make it clap. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. Oh, gonna... he's tweaking. <laughs> you can see from this clip. Bro's definitely tweaking. He's got major issues. But what do you expect? You came out there dressed like a hoochie. You came out there dressed like you want to be put out there and just done up and thrown away. What do you expect for a weirdo to do? And this is what men be trying to tell women out here in these streets. Like, you are not safe. Y'all want to go out here. Y'all want to dress like that. Y'all want to look like that. Y'all want to objectify yourselves like that. But there are weird people out here like that that are going to think like, dress like that. She deserve whatever, uh, deserve whatever I tell or whatever I do or however I treat her because she's putting herself out there, it's okay for that. That's a whole another conversation in itself. And bro's definitely tweaking, bro. He's never talked to a baddie before. He's never talked to someone that even looks remotely good because you wouldn't be acting like this. You wouldn't be acting like you ain't have no home training. You ain't never seen a girl that's actually beautiful or anything. But what can you expect? Bro looks like he's not even got a fifth grade education level he looks like he might be on third grade education level still bro he couldn't even get half his words out and that's sad bro like the, the youth out here is struggling bro they're struggling he worried about wearing a beanie during the summer and uh, creepily looking at women and stuff I, I don't know bro let's get back into this clip <laughs> you tweaking? You fine as hell. You don't fuck with me, huh? Because <laughs> I told you to do a 360 on tweaking. No, it was the lab, and then what's this right here? <laughs> yeah, it's like white. My bad. I probably been licking my lips. I ain't got no Carmax on. My bad. Nah, bro. No, we're not gonna blame that on Carmax, bro. Staring at a girl so hard and tweaking over her to the point to where you start drooling is some weirdo activity. Have y'all ever seen someone that just like hold it in to where they can't hold it together when they see someone that looks remotely good that they start drooling like that, bro? I thought that was something out of the movies. Like, bro is really a weirdo out here in the streets, bro. But like, let me know in the comment section below. What do y'all think, bro? Are we doomed as a generation or as a society? We got weirdos out here. We got women that are out here objectifying themselves and then calling men that are weird that see what they're doing and think that like they should deserve however they act around them because they're wearing and presenting themselves in a certain way what do y'all think about all of that let me know i'm gonna see y'all another one see me too out peace